Well, the growing deer population in urban areas of Wisconsin is becoming a problem in some communities. Places like Ashwaubenon are reporting a higher number of car deer crashes within the village limits. And tonight, community leaders will meet, hoping to find a solution. NBC 26's Eric Crest is live in the newsroom with a look at the options. For many that live in Ashwaubenon, deer sightings are a pretty normal occurrence, but they are increasing, and now village leaders have to decide how to manage that deer population. For many in Ashwaubenon, it's what's happening in their backyard that trumps the television any night of the week. We get deer back there wholesale. We have a super highway. Rich Langen is ready for them, though. Camera in tow. He doesn't like to miss any of it. We see dozens of deer, about 3.30 every afternoon. Deer numbers are on the rise in Ashwaubenon. With no real predators and an all-you-can-eat buffet around every corner, this is a good place to call home. Now we're coming to the point where a decision has to be made. Village leaders say the deer are becoming a nuisance. Last week, somebody told me there were two accidents involving deer in the area. In a city environment where there is no harvesting going on, definitely can skyrocket pretty quickly. And with the threat of herds growing in a short time span, they say something has to happen. And I can imagine in a few years they could double in size, um, especially if the resources are there. Right now, the leading option, according to village leaders, is a bow hunt season within village limits. And even for the guy who couldn't shoot a deer with anything but this, that option makes sense. I hate to say it, but yes, we're going to have to control them eventually. Now tonight, village leaders will likely decide if a bow hunt will be put into place this season. But there are some pretty strict guidelines as to who can hunt and where and when they can do so. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Eric Crest, NBC 26.